Hi survivors, it's me Purpose and reporting to you. Hope you guys are doing well because what's going on in this world is not. Yeah, I'm about to sound alarm off on these liberals as usual. Well, allegedly, but that's what's really going on. Um, quite a few of y'all have been emailing me about this movie sounds of freedom and i thank you guys for it because y'all know y'all really don't be in the media you know surfing the web and all that too much but a lot of things are very knowledgeable on here for us to be informed about these days and times because we could see all hell is broken loose around us and like one of you said it's been evil but now it's more rapid and it's more exposed than ever. Everybody want to know what's going on in the world and in this country. We seeing that it's severe problems over here. We seeing that it's a lot of evil. It's always been, but it's more now than ever. But anyway, going back to this movie, Sounds of Freedom, that Mel Gibson either produced or executive produced in regards to he uh, put up the finances for it and whatnot. It's, it's, it's about children and him, uh, being victims of human trafficking in big ways where it's exposing the powers that be. It's exposing Hollywood and how they use these tactics and do certain things to abduct children, allegedly. But this was really going on. <clears throat> and things like that. They were talking about that W-A-R over there overseas that y'all none leader be funding. <laughs> well, it's being exposed to in regards to all the crookedness and the scandals and all the evil that surrounds it. Um, the guy that directed this movie was saying how he approached Mel Gibson and he was saying, look, I'm trying to help these children over there in u dash k dash." R-A-I-N-E. Uh, a lot of them are coming up missing. A lot of them are being victims to human trafficking. And I um, I have been finding a lot of them. And I need your help. And Mel Gibson started helping him and giving money towards that cause. And which kudos to them because we got to have some good vigilantes out here. We got to have some good people um, <clears throat> out here in these dark days and times to step up and not be afraid of the powers that be and not be afraid of this wicked system and this wicked G-O-V and all the things that they do <clears throat> that have something to do with all this nonsense, evil foolishness. So anyway, they went on and made this movie, Sounds Like Freedom, and Hollywood and, 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 and the powers that be not liking it. Because what it's doing is it exposing a lot of the crooked activity and crooked operations. Dealing with young, innocent, beautiful children. And y'all, parents, y'all have to be very careful with your children. I was also seeing on the internet, well, we all need to be careful, but watch y'all children. These, they didn't ask to be here. And they can't even defend themselves. <clears throat> Going back to a story I saw on the internet, this lady in Texas, here here in Texas, her baby was playing two year old, and you know you can't you could you could turn around for a brief second, and they went on wandering off. Right, this man had picked up a baby, got in a pickup truck, and all hell broke loose. She and her neighbors went crazy. That's just how quick they work, y'all. And if y'all think people not watching, people are always watching. Man, y'all be surprised what go on on in the minds of these crazy, evil, satanic, sadistic people out here in the world. So anyway, so they're exposing it. So now they're saying that the liberals and Hollywood's coming out trying to defend the movie. They're trying to shut it down. I heard it's in the theaters or, or whatever the case is, but I thank y'all for sending me this story, y'all, because it's really, really bad what's going on. And then I also heard, like, in... <clears throat> In the spiritual realm, in, in with sacrifice, and a lot of people don't know that a lot of these companies that I, and organizations that I just mentioned, they really into rituals, they really into spells, they really into curses, and they're really into sacrificing 
uh, people and children to get ahead and to get things. This is how they advance in their industries. And the highest sacrifice that they can make or take to someone is the blood in a, in, in a child. And I hate talking about it. I hate even thinking about it because it's so satanic. It's so evil how the minds of certain people think, especially these powerful people. So y'all be careful. We all need to be careful when we think we want to be rich and powerful. Do y'all know what these people do to get that way? Do y'all know how many lives they take and the crooked things and evil things that they do to gain power and to gain status? Sometimes we just have to be grateful for things that God give us. I'm not saying that don't try to move forward. Don't try to get a lot of money, whatever like that. But I'm just saying just sometimes we just never know uh, the evil sides of darkness and what comes with it. But they're exposed in this movie. And, it, it, and it's, it's just crazy because all the while, while we're in this world where all this evil stuff is transpiring right around us, then you have good people that's exposing this darkness that's going on. So I just wanted to bring light to those who haven't heard about it. You can Google, you can go to YouTube, put in a search bar, Sounds of Freedom. There's a lot of YouTubers talking about it and exposing it, and they're going more into depth about it. <clears throat> and um, yeah, you know, we just have to really be careful and watch our family members and watch our children these days and times. Thank you, Queen and Bernie, and all you, you uh, Miss Howell, all you guys who have sent me the information about this. I look at I I I looked at the links y'all gave me, but that's as far as I can take it. Y'all know I'm a um I'm very spiritual, I'm very sensitive. I can't take a lot of it. When it's dealing with children and it's all we already going through a lot, but it is knowledgeable to know about it so we, we could be aware and we could kind of just stay out the way, man. This is why I always say pray, pray and stay out the way. It's so much darkness going on, it's so much evil going on. But at the same time, by God's good mercy and grace, we also have some good people out here that's exposing it and that's doing something about it. So y'all watch this world, watch the weather, smell your water, boil your water before you use it and keep surviving.